Hey, Air Signs, hope that you're doing fantastic. This is Shannon with Apex Tarot, a pure spirit, and this is your next 72 hour reading. Uh, you guys showed up in the uh, Earth of read that I just did for the next 72 hours. I'm going to tell you right now that it is an extremely intense uh, reading that I just did. And one of the cards that showed up there, it was the um, the three <laughs> the three of um, wands. And in that card, there's a lake of fire. All right, and somebody's standing there. And I know that you guys are air energy, but uh, I'm just telling you what happened here because you guys showed up in that reading real heavy. And you guys are going to be everywhere because the sun right now is in Libra. Well, you know, Libra. Everybody's under the sun, and and there's a lot of scales being balanced, a lot of just all kinds of stuff like law issues, spiritual and natural. It's karmic right now. People better really take heed, okay? Because what I'm fixing to tell you is as soon as I got done with that video, y'all, uh, I have this, I have this, uh, I've gotten on my camera before and talked about Uriel. There's a, there's a, there's a angel in the sun and it's called Uriel. Your I, God, E-L means God. Well, this was sitting on my table and as soon as I got done with that video, started to upload it, it fell over. I hit my table and it fell over. Well, I noticed that I had something written here on it and it just happened to read, as the days of Noah, fire, dash. And I thought, my God, because I just got on camera on Sunday and talked about a, a revolutionary change just like that that the spirit was going to do and that and, and the sun is a big ball of fire the people are really heed my word because i've been all day today every single uh i don't know uh, uh videos so far so far as of right now i have felt such intensity and people that are going to stay in their wickedness because all that came out on that earth reading was nothing but fussing and fighting and carrying on and things like that because we are in a war. People are in a war with their self. They're in a war with other people. They're in a war. I don't care. There's just war going on. Positive and negative all day long and people are straightening the hell up. And so this is really intense. I'm still feeling intense stuff. Hopefully that is not what's going to come out on your reading for the next 72 hours. But people better really heed the word, what I'm giving across here. I don't care if you like me or not, click off my channel, I guess. Uh, this is, this, this uh, channel is to help people wake up in what hour we are in, okay? Now, yes, this is a general read, but, but I, I know my gifting and my calling, and I know the things that, that the Creator has done on my channel, and I know who I am in the earth realm, and I'm humbled, and I'm very, it, it makes me tremble. And sometimes the, the creator have me get on camera and do a word that I don't want to, but I have to, because I've learned that I'm almost 50 years old, I, I know who I am, and uh, I've walked through all kinds of stuff, and when this creator says, I want you to give a word, and it, I have to give it, and he's always showed up. So whoever this is, whatever comes out on any of my reads, it either is going to resonate with you or it's not. Uh, if you put negative comments, comments I'm flicking you off my channel because I'm done with this kind of conflict stuff I'm addressing it because as the days of Noah the, the earth is on fire right now energetically it is on fire and the creator is sending that big ball of fire to to do a revolutionary thing in the earth realm okay so those of you who want to get on the correct side I'd do it right here right now and quit causing the damn fight in the earth realm because the creator is blowing his nostrils and it don't look good and it don't sound good but it has to be cleared out and so I'm being used as a conduit uh, to give a word okay so I, I, I just had to get on here and say that on this video I don't know that I'll repeat this on the water or the fire but I may but, but I'm just saying what you guys showed up in the earth element reading sun moon rising of Venus I don't care you might have that in your chart you might be the person causing the crap in the earth realm whatever it is people better heed the word that that didn't just happen on purpose or without purpose by the creator that that was sitting there on my table and what was in that uh card that i was noticing um which i didn't even really touch on that card except for just a, f 
a second at the beginning of, of you know, I always point that out that the lake is on fire there. But the five of swords is an earth element. So whether it's you or someone you're dealing with, uh, because energies can be interchangeable and we all have these energies within us. Th this is serious right now. This is tribulous stuff that we're in right now in the earth realm. People need to wake up. So with that said, let's get on this uh, reading. And let's allow the truth to come, even if it's got to be cut like that. Because it sets you free. It sets you and I free. Thank you, sweet divine. I just bind and block all negative forces. And I ask for the forceful truth to come up to the surface. I command the truth to come to the surface. The whole truth and nothing but the truth. And I ask for your highest wisdom to come in this realm and to give a word to set people free. And I just thank you for it, sweet divine. I thank you for using me for clarity and to humble myself and others in situations where we need to be beautiful, beautiful. I love it. And this is about home. This is about being mothering. And this is about getting the victory. And this is, this is really, this is Libra energy herself, the empress. This is things that are going on in a big wide range. This is public and this is public energy, right? And it starts in our homes. Uh, so Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, this is the, uh, the first three cards that's coming out here. Uh, and, you know, the empress... She's married to the emperor, and the emperor takes war, and he wars in the empire and sends out a war on the kingdoms, right? And we saw king and queenship come out on the earth uh, element. This is what's going on in the earth right now. Wow. And uh, we've seen this card in the earth uh, energy as well. So this is for air, sun, moon, rising, Venus for the next 72 hours. What you need to heed, what you need to change. There is the king of pentacles also came out. And so since the queen is sitting here, uh, this would be a part of the um, uh, emperor or it's somebody in the kingdom in high, in high regard or something like that. We'll see what the rest of the stuff comes out on your reading. The king of pentacles here, somebody who is grounded leader. Who is mastery, authority, control, you know, protective, grounded. This is boss situations, people in high authority, mothers, home situations, victory, um, public stuff going on here. Amazing. Let's get into this because I'm doing a full spread and I only got so uh, many minutes on my videos. So we're going to have to get through this since I had a long introduction and I, I don't apologize because the spirit had me say what I needed to say. And so here we go. Happen to have strength. So, and that's exactly right. People need to have strength right now. Now, for the, on the up and up, there's many people that are in their leadership and they get victory every time because they know how to connect to the divine, and that's powerful. And this is celebration happening. Big time celebration, celebration, celebrate. This beautiful energy, air, because people are really getting the skills. A balanced right and uh, getting their strength back or needing to because once you gain your strength this is what you look like this is how we show up right so uh, let's get into it yep fussing and fighting carry it on but let me tell you something overall energy is that that the you know you can't fight against uh emperor empress stuff you just can't do it i don't care who the hell you are you ain't gonna do it uh there is too much at stake and uh people who know how to get their liberty 11 11 right here right 11 11 justice herself is sitting on the throne with her wand in her hand and nobody can get past this nobody I don't care who you are. So if you are the one sitting in the, your upright, then beautiful, you get to celebrate. And if not, well, then everybody else is going to have to have the strength to get through it. But there is competition and all that kind of bull crap in the earth going on right here, right now. And uh, But really, there's no competition. This is just low-level energy showing up here. Stupid. What's crossing this? Victory. Uh, people wanting their own victory. Well, you, 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 Let me tell you how to get the victory. Is to walk in truth. Uh, the chariot is about balancing and focusing and, and really having that movement done by the mind with your self-control. It's got Jupiter in this car, which is m law. So you've got not only the scales of Libra showing up with the Empress here in the next 72 hours, but you also got law and, you know, people in high authority showing up here. It's going to take victory and movement 
and get grounded in situations here. Now, this is what's helpful is to come in here and take these people to jail for starting this bull crap in the earth realm, getting people up in their head about things with conflict, right? And this is an opportunity for people to grow up. This is a change here, okay? And that's what's um, helpful is the chariot to get focused, to really get, you know, uh, have that willpower, and that's also what's a challenge there. In the deep past, a small little offer, children, uh, some type of a message came that caused something to get, you know, people where they're at right now to have to go to war and, and stuff like that. And uh, whatever this is, some kind of physical something in the mail, maybe your body, maybe maybe all this is for some of you is just having to have strength because, you know, you're battling it within your physical body itself, anything physical, uh, maybe a small payment, you know, or you, something you thought was small ended up being something huge and uh, where your children were concerned, or maybe your children did something that really caused something huge as well to, to start this conflict, whatever this was, maybe it was a pregnancy, somebody got pregnant, had to get strength, and uh, did something that was very public, and uh, now there's kind of conflict and, and competition and stuff like that, and having to really get grounded right now in a situation what just happened this is also a big community card all this stuff is known stuff here and to have to have strength that means you have that you're fighting you're fighting you have to have strength because there's fighting going on here so something just happened here so what just happened caused a fight because this is the, in the, that position the immediate past there was happiness but it's causing some kind of competition here. War. Having to really be self-controlled and focus here. But the overall energies is there is going to be a victory. And there are going to be people that set up on their throne. And it is going to be widely known in a situation. And some people are really going to have to tame the lion the beast within them. Because this bull crap's going away. Um, what's at the top of the mind? Yes. Pretty much the same thing that's crossing this. This is about the emotions. This is about law. This is about travel. This is about so much stuff. And that's what's helpful and what's the challenge. Some people just need to get away and they don't know how because all they know how to do is fuss and fight. What's at the top of the mind is needing to go within. Right? Needing to get healing in the mind. There's the star there. Something's very much guided and well when you know empress energies come out and leadership come out here uh then obviously people don't just sit in those positions for nothing it's by the by way of the divine what's in the mind is you know some people just want to escape some people are uh cloaked in a, a disguise and they know that they are uh because the hermit represents a disguise Right, and that's a, some of that kind of stuff has caused people to have to war. Stupidness. Something could have just happened, and this, this could have just went on in, from the Virgo season. We just passed into the uh, Libra season right now. So, in the immediate future, fussing, gossiping, right, looking right on over at that fighting, or is the or uh, some people are also looking over at being controlled. Uh, this is what's crossing. Better be careful because the law is crossing this stuff. Okay? This also secret service stuff happening here. Uh, you know, this is known stuff. Too many cards about known stuff. Okay? There is going to be a celebration. There is going to be a... The victory is going to be won. It's showing itself right here. There are going to be skills that are going to be balanced. And people know it. 11-11. There there's going to be payouts... Whether this is job stuff, home stuff, I don't care what it is. Um, the law is crossing this stuff. And, and all the low-level energies here, they're, they're, getting, they're, they're, they're not going to win. <laughs> uh, so in the near future, we got children's stuff here. The truth, a new page being turned over, right? A secret service happening to people because of, people have to be serviced because of this kind of stuff. That's why the law is crossing it. The upright the upright law is we got crooked on both sides. I don't care who you are. 
what's the the concern is death well the concern is death if something was a disguise and the conflict and the passions and stuff like that and money was given in a home situation and people are watching things happen in here very passionately and if this is just a lot of sex and stuff like that and, and needing strength and stuff and this can also represent a disguise of some kind and if somebody did something in the past where a death was concerned or transformed something very, 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 very big because this is big stuff that represents huge, wide-known stuff that have to have strength within it, then the concern is the huge transformation that's going to come out, right? This is the truth up, looking at all this stuff. A lot of people here involved in a situation. Uh, what What is the concern? Well, if we're talking secret service, if we're pairing these up like that, and we know the law is, is in there, then that is private investigative stuff with Scorpio energy. People better get concerned. They better get real concerned because what they do, they're going to pay up. They're going to pay up. The skills are being balanced. She's on her throne here, right? There's victory to be had. There's payouts. People have taken money for, for things and gotten children involved in things, and they're going to pay up. They better get, have some strength about you because you're not getting away with that kind of stuff. And people are going to be able to really get um, uh, in a place of celebration, we are going to be able to celebrate once all the, the bullcrap people are out of the earth and our homes are going to come back together. How are people viewing this? This came up in the earth reading. They have all kinds of fussing and fighting on that stuff. And you guys are right here at that place. <laughs> Childlike stuff happening. Either by you or you with others or others doing that to you. I don't care who you are. It, 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 it's involving a lot of people. This is, like I said, publicity. A lot of people. It's about the world. People are walking away or looking at it as they should walk away because they're unfulfilled. There's deception here with the moon. There's illusions here. There's... Parental issues. We know that because the Empress represents that. We know that because the King of Pentacles also can represent parenting and things like that. We got children out here, big and strong. We got the family card here. We got things happening on trips. We've also got this card, also can be front stage stuff because it goes to the fifth house and that's about having in your heart and stuff and having to have compassion. Well, where people won't have compassion, the law gets involved. And this is the eighth house, so, you know, that's the sex situations, that's walking away, that's secret service, that's uh, uh, it's undercover things, that's things coming up out of, out, of, uh, out of a disguise into the light. Something's very much guided. All this stuff is guided. Some of this stuff is prophecy stuff happening. Like I said at the top of this uh, video, as the days of Noah, it's the earth is on fire. The first time around, the prophecy said it was by water, and the second time it happened to be by fire, right? Well, if you know anything about prophecy and some of the writings in the Greek, it says that the tongue is a fire of itself, a world, right? And people's tongues are on fire and fussing and fighting and brainstorming and disguising things. And that's a lot of, that is a lot of fire. The hermit himself even holds a wand. Six wands here. There's 12, 13, 40, 15, 16 wands out here so far. Plus, you got the strength card which is uh, also fire that's a lot of fire on the earth right venus herself is air and earth so we're gonna let she's wide widely known we got the king of pentacles which is earth element so it starts inside people okay it just doesn't look the way that we thought it would but people are going to manifest it right out here in the earth and it really will manifest in the actual earth itself people aren't careful because that's how powerful you and i are People better get a clue. Get the higher mind of a thing. They understand what's really happening. Heaven, this is the heavens coming down here. Two, one, two, three, four, five, five higher canas. A change. There is a change happening in the earth. And starting within people. And it first starts within people, and then it manifests right out here, like I just said. So fire is happening on the inside of people. Because as above, so below. It will take place. We already know that the last time that uh, the um, the flood happened, we've got whole cities underneath uh, the, the oceans and stuff like that. People better really heed this. That they, we might not see it in our lifetime, but it's already beginning. It's already beginning, though, in our life time right now. 
Wow. The hope to be rebuild the tower. The hope is to get people out of your damn internet services. There's also, uh, you know, intelligence and uh, the hope is to get illuminated. The hope is to have truth set people free. The hope is to have a new solid foundation. The hope is to heal partnerships and stuff, be able to come back together and uh, hold one another the way you should, right? This is a very sexual card as well. And some, you know, the hope is to get over sexual addictions as well. But this is also about technology. And people spying in on people because this this card can represent stuff like that, intelligence and stuff like that. And we got a lot of that here with the Scorpio energy, with the scales of Libra happening, people spying in on people's crap. The world itself showing up. Beautiful because scales are like I said, there is a victory that showed right on up. The Empress don't just come out for nothing. We already had the eleven eleven fire. 11-11 with the fire. The world is the outcome. The testing. Right? The earth realm. Catching on fire. And, and it is a victory though. It's going to be a victory for those who set up on their throne in truth. That's how we get the victory. The Empress don't come out and, and then a failure card come out. I don't think so. Amazing. Celebration, celebration. Uh, I did a reading the other day and she came out, she was holding her cup, remember? It's time to get grounded. This is very grounded. This is going to be a major change, success, performance, victory, triumph, rewards well deserved when you and I pass the test. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. My God, and we're in the seventh month. Or the seventh high, the seventh house is uh, Libra, and she comes out herself. That's amazing. Next seventy-two hours, uh, air signs or cross watcher or wherever you find yourself. Actually, everybody should watch this because we're all under the sun right now, and this is this is worldwide. This isn't just uh, just air I energy. Everybody's got a voice, and everybody's got their two cents worth, and everybody's brainstorming and fussing and fighting, and better better, better be getting that uh, uh, self control because the earth is on fire right now. It really, really is. I felt it all day. It's been so intense. So anyway. Good luck to y'all. Shalom.